What's up, YouTube? So today we received this pinnacle. This is Fabrished. I got the very cheap from eBay. Inside the box, very important, you'll find two CDs with serial numbers. This CD was published in 2007. We will have her antenna. Let's build it straight. Unplug the red plug. Plug it in. Zoom it out. It is ready. Next, we get S video cable. So basically, I understand we can plug DVR box or camera or anything. It's basically like TV in. Then inside we will get receiver itself with USB and remote with already two batteries pre-installed inside. Let's tie it in. And also we will get external adapter. Let's take it, let's take all this out that we don't need. Keep the CDs. Alright, so right now we will power on the laptop. I don't have CD-ROM drive on it, so I just went ahead and copy these two CDs to a USB card. Just select all the files and copy paste them. And now I will show you how to install the Steven Sooner in 2017 with old codes and update it to the latest version of Pinnacle PC TV. Alright, to do this, let's go to the folder where we copy CDs. Then the most important on the top file click a right click properties compatibility and run it as windows vista not as per one or as per two just windows vista and run program as administrator double click on setup click yes right now we will install studio quick start Now it will ask you to enter the serial number that you have with your original CD from 2007. Let's go and patch it in. Alright. And I'm connecting to internet right now. Now we will click remind me later and take out think about emails and click register now. Remind me later. All right, now it's take the code. Typical. And let's install all the pinnacles today. It will give you this mistake, an error about digital sign driver is required. Just click close. It's all right. And do not plug your TV tuner yet. Click no, I will start my computer later. Now we need to install second CD. Let's go ahead. Same go to setup file. Properties, compatibility, run as Windows Vista, run this computer as administrator. Next, agree. And now we install in this CD, the black one. You ask us a cut, let's go ahead and punch it in. Click OK. Don't forget to take out the mark about email. Take the cut, install for anyone, complete, install.
All right, now we will ask us to restart computer. We won't do it. I will try to run Pinnacle right now. Pinnacle TV without even plugging the thing. And look, we will have Microsoft that framework error right here. 2.0, I try to download it manually. I cannot install it. Then when I'm trying to delete Pinnacle Center Pro it's not allow me it's saying program not compatible with the system look doesn't support your operation system so I use third part software we'll use re1 installer pro we'll choose Pinnacle TV Center Pro click on install then let's click moderate you see it give us an error well, let's do scan they will find all the files you see a bunch of them just select all of them and click next yes and that will totally wipe out Pinnacle TV Center Pro the old version but it will keep all third part programs that was installed with this all the plugins just click finish yes and right now we can see it's gone all the way now what we're gonna do we'll install TV center setup 6.4.9.10.33 and when we will unzip the folder we need to go to TV center 64 bit on setup file we need to make a right click properties compatibility and put it only to Windows Vista and run as administrator after that double click click yes right now we will ask us to install net 2.0 make sure you connect it to internet click install then click next accept the terms next next you see it's already my code patched in make sure full version then click next, next, complete, next, install. All right, after this, uncheck this mark, plug your pinnacle stick to USB port. I will discover new device right here 800e now we can even leave the check mark launch it version 6491033 now we'll have setup wizard click next we use an antenna click next check out analog tv leave ATSC antenna click advanced options make normal click OK start scan now I will scan for all the channels that are available in air through antenna all right we find 40 channels click next start TV center close wizard and TV is on with the sound if I go to settings some people have problem with this Dolby Digital Plus let's go ahead click active activate 
Activate now. And after that, just close the. It's still not activated, but I have sound. Let's check different channels. So works. Then settings. You can set up your remote control, which one you have. I have this one. Let's choose it. You can test it if you want to. But it should work fine. I can change channels. Control volume. And it's just working with the regular antenna. Thanks for watching guys, click like and subscribe.